Hello, travelers. Welcome to the section of tricks and secrets of the Chinchetto channel. In this section, tourist guides from all over the world will reveal the secrets of the best destinations. Look for the section on the web and access by clicking on it. In today's video we are going to travel to the Republic of Montenegro. Come and join us. Once in Montenegro, the tour guide Jessica Rubio is going to show us some secrets that the city of Kotor holds. I am Jessica, and I would like you to join me today to the Republic of Montenegro. Tip number one. Tour the Bay of Kotor. The Bay of Kotor is a natural area known as the southernmost fjord in Europe. Although it is not actually a fjord, it is an estuary. The Bay of Kotor or Boka Kotorska can be traveled by car and, in the middle, you can see that there are two small islands. A natural island, the island of St. George, and the artificial island of Our Lady of the Rock. Here I advise you to get on a boat in the town of Parast, and cruise to the island to visit its 15th century church. Tip number two. Don't miss a walk through the city of Kotor. Both the city and the bay are declared as World Heritage of UNESCO, natural, cultural, and historical. This city of Kotor is very small and fully walled. My recommendation is that you take a walk through the streets and squares and that you dedicate a little time and effort to climb the wall in zigzag to the top of the mountain. When it comes to eating, you will not have many problems since the city of Kotor has a quite interesting gastronomic offer of Mediterranean and local food. For example in the Kono Ballardino or the Astoria Hotel restaurant, which has an interior very pretty. And in the Bay of Kotor, do not forget to go to the cafeteria in the Strait of Barrage.